Here we go, we're ready. Ready, here we go. Oh yeah! I screwed up. I messed up my schedule this week, had to make some changes, was gonna take the camera with me to go film at a pest control convention, and I totally dropped the ball. So um, I'm gonna post this and put this here. It's a little bit shorter, but you'll just kind of see some of the things we've been, uh, we've been working on. So welcome to the vlog. I meant to film yesterday, or we'd travel for the entire day. Might have been some okay stuff because it was a really long day with a, with a, with a bunch of kids. But I'm up here in Vail, Colorado. I'll probably bring my wife on and, uh, and update our travel day. It was a really long day, had a lot of stuff happen, but we made it up here. We had some quick lunch before we drove up the mountain, and then the hell began. I think it's an hour... Ooh, 40 minutes. Hour and 40 minutes to get up there. And we started the drive, and immediately it was massive traffic that we thought was gonna be an accident. It was... I never saw an accident. It was just traffic the entire time. Yeah. And downpouring snow the entire time. It got it got bad enough our kids were so tired. They've been up since five o'clock in the morning. Oh, but don't forget the many times because you're traveling with kids you have to stop and go to the bathroom. Yeah. And change diapers. Which we had to stop several times. <laughs> and to keep finding an exit to stop at. So it got it got so bad to a point to where everybody was just fed up and the snow kept getting worse. We almost didn't think we were, we we were going to make it. We thought about turning around. Four and a half hours to get there, and everybody was done. Our kids are on a you know, two-hour time change, so to them it's 9.45, and to the baby, she just like, didn't yeah. even know what to do with herself. Beyond exhausted. So we get in the townhouse. Above our bed, all these creepy masks are like hanging. 20. Yeah, and there was, there was definitely a Jesus mask and definitely right next to it, a Satan mask. All right, right, so right over the bed. Animals. And... Yeah, I feel pretty sure there's a camera in one of those yeah, masks. Yeah, I was like, there's us. a mask. There's for sure a mask here that has a camera. Yeah, so that was pretty creepy. Townhouse was nice, kind of falling apart. But yeah. the masks were a that little weird. first day where everything was kind of going crazy. Yeah. Lucy or Scarlett was like, what's that sound? And sure enough, there was a huge leak in the roof and, and it was going through all the floors. In. Yeah. Of the house. Yeah. So we get up the next day. One of our kids wasn't wasn't feeling very well, and so we just kind of hung around the house a little bit. Um, most of the rest of the weekend stuff was fine. Good job, Lou. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Oh me. There you go. You're up. Yeah, we had to look around because our because we had a kid that didn't feel too good. We changed the day we were gonna go tubing, and so um, we had, was everyone was booked and sold out. So we had to drive 30, 40 minutes really back yeah. down the mountain to go to another place to go to go tubing. It was cheaper and I think still still just as fun. Copper Mountain. It was great. You were really scared. You were more scared than the kids were. <laughs> you know, like... Backwards, which is worse because <coughs> you can't see what's coming. 
and you're going backwards and. But our five and eight year olds were totally fine the whole time. And I tried to keep it together for them, but I couldn't. <laughs> Two to six inches of snow, we get up the next day and we drive all the way to the airport. Roads are worse than they were when we drove to yeah, Vail. Yeah, they were icy. So really, really bad roads. We finally get to the airport. We get there in time that we can at least sit down and eat some food so the girls were okay. You kind of think you're home free because our kids are really good travelers because we travel so much with them. Um, nope. But I sort of call, I did kind of call it on the first day. I knew that the, our New York trip, which if you go back and watch that that uh, that video, that went way perfect. too smooth. It, it was went, perfect. It went way too good. We Karma owed us a little bit of suffering. Baby slept on both of those flights. Yeah, so we got on the plane and and our, our baby, I don't know, she's since learned in Colorado how to scream at the top of her lungs, like a really high pitched, like if you were stabbing an animal, like a wild animal, yeah. and they were screaming. It's That's a what she brand did the new trick that time. she learned on the plane. And this, <gasps> this throwing back. Yeah. Thing. So she wouldn't sleep. She screamed the whole time. I'm sure everyone around us was totally, totally loving it. We were those people. We finally land. Then you really think you're home free. Get our bags. Go get out to the parking garage, get in the car. Everyone's pretty tired, but luckily it's only like 7 o'clock. And uh, go to start the car. Then the car doesn't start. <laughs> So I was, I think I was pretty done by. <laughs> yeah, you were really mad. I told Erin I don't want to travel with our with our baby again until she's three, and so two and a half more years <laughs> until we take her somewhere. Because if she yells that pterodactyl yell again on the plane, I'm gonna jump out. Oh yeah, don't worry, she's still doing it. She's still something in Colorado broke her. We had a great trip. Um, it is Tuesday afternoon. Um, I'm gonna wrap up the vlog here. There was supposed to be a lot of stuff going on on Monday and Tuesday. We were gonna bring the camera along, film it all. We had some really good meetings here. Um, not a whole lot that was videotaped. The big thing was I was actually headed over to the uh, pest control convention here in Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, we got our times messed up, plus because we're apparently not a member. It was really, really expensive for all of us to go. So I sent uh, my brother, our service manager here, over there to kind of check out maybe new technologies, um, possibly new things that, that we can use here in our business to make it better. Um, really crazy busy week. I'm headed off to New York tomorrow. We'll uh, take my wife out there, so we'll, we'll bring the camera along. We'll, we'll, we'll see what's going on out there. But the main thing we've been really focusing on, it's been so incredibly busy, we're trying to make sure that a couple of our videos that we're trying to produce right now are all the way on brand. So when we market those and put ad spend behind them that they're totally on brand. Um, we are also putting together a couple campaigns, um, some different click funnel campaigns to try and drive um, more customers to us. And then in addition to that, we're spending a ton of time with all of my managers um, kind of building out the customer journey. And so I talked about that a lot, a little bit last week. We'd spent a lot more time on that this week. Um, it's been a super interesting process for me to kind of hear um, what's important to people. Um, I'm learning a lot about what is actually important to the people that work for us here and what they're actually looking for. And so we've now tested out a couple different ways um, of uh, in motivating, incentivizing, compensating schedules for employees and uh, we're, we're learning a tremendous amount about, about what motivates them. So the goal here is to create something for our customers that gives them 10 times the value of what they're actually paying us. And so we're starting to build that out. Um, we're, we're kind of laying the groundwork um, of what that's gonna look like. Next week, I will turn the camera on. I will get a lot of our meetings where we actually start to build out exactly what the framework is and how we intend on giving the best customer experience um, of anywhere. So um, for now, that's the end of the vlog. Um, hope you enjoyed some of the stuff in Vail, Colorado. It was, again, it was an awesome trip. Um, headed off to New York City tomorrow, back on Friday, um, where we will uh, pick up from there and uh, still grinding it out, trying to get this whole marketing thing going. So um, that's it, we'll see you then.